Hey look, I'm the opening of every anime ever. Kiyosana. I didn't realize that I was in love with him until I overheard the other classmates talk about him in front of me. So, you broke up with him? How old was he again? 35? He was so clingy. I need someone innocent. What's the name of that cute boy we saw earlier? Was it Makio Sono? Yes, him! You want to ask him out? Why not? I will ask him out tomorrow after classes. I can't let that happen. Murder. Now that's a love game I can get behind. Bet I can use this screwdriver to fix my problems. I must bury the body. If you say anything, the same's gonna happen to you, bitches. Oh, looks like somebody's already done the digging for me. This makes it fucking easier. I'm ready to confess my feelings. Sono Senpai? Nani, what's up, Akari-chan? Um, well, let's go somewhere together. Like a cafe or something. After school? Sure, I'm feeling hungry. This is a nice place. Thanks for inviting me. I've been wanting to say that I love. Ow! It's hot! Ah, ah. Oops, I'm so sorry. I. Uh, don't worry about it. I'm just going to run and change my clothes. I heard that there's a new student in your class? Yes, a new girl. A foreign exchange student. She introduced herself yesterday. Her name is Angelina Ivanova. She came somewhere from Eastern Europe and wants to know more about our country. She told me that I'm handsome and asked me to show her around, then invited me to the tea club after classes. That's a game face. That's I've got bitches to kill look. If a woman's giving that look, you know you fucked up big time. She will not stay between me and my beloved. Some interesting places around school. Oh, I could show you where I bury all the people that try to mess with my senpai. That's a beautiful view from the roof. Now just get really close to the edge. I need to find a weapon. Come on. Come on, bitch. Come on. Up down you go. Must bury the body. Why do you need to bury the body? She could have just been depressed. Angelina wants to drink tea with me. It looks like she's not gonna show up. I'd rather work out. You can't trust every girl. Have you done your homework? You can only trust me. I knew she wouldn't show up. Luckily, I'm always around. Yeah, it's good to have someone to drink tea with. Well, I'm done for today. See ya. But I wanted something more. Sono Senpai, I was looking for you everywhere. It's a home run. I thought we're gonna meet up and spend some time together. Oh, sorry. I've just met the guys from our baseball team, and they convinced me to play a game. Hey, can't you see he has a talent? Now Sono Kun needs to train all the time. With a player like him, we'll win prefecture competition and go to the national championship. Don't bother him. He's our player. There's no room for girls on the baseball field. This is their last game ever. Why are we watching baseball practice? It's boring. Ooh, a baseball bat. Let's see if I can get a home run. Smoking's bad for your health, mate. Can lead to your death. Yeah, I can't kick the habit. I'm going to smoke. 
See, I fucking told you. Oh, <laughs> right in the fucking nuts. Hey. Hi. I've been thinking about baseball, and maybe it's just not my thing. Well, maybe we can go on a walk together? Sure, why not? Akari-chan, how could you forget your umbrella when the weatherman said it's going to rain? Just get closer to me, senpai, or I'll get wet. Who's that girl, Sono-senpai? I am Moriyama Yuka, wife of Makio-kun. Wife? Uh, wife? Oh, by ancient tradition, when we were born, our parents agreed that we will marry each other when we grow up. Yesterday was my birthday, so now I'll live with my fiancé like I'm supposed to. Moving a little fast, don't you think? <laughs> I'm digging a grave in the background, that's awesome. You will go here. We'll survive only one bride. Better get a knife for the bride for her cake. Ohayo gozaimasu, sensei. I am Yuka Moriyama. Hello, Moriyama-san. Your parents called me already and told me about your situation. I live with my future husband, and I want to go to the same school. You will join class 2-1. We will get you a new school uniform. Oh, she's not going to need a uniform. Don't worry about that. But can I have the same class 3-1 with my husband? Wait, so you want to live with him, go to school with him, and be in the same class? Fucking give the guy a break. Get some boundaries. Oh, okay then. Arigato, sensei. <laughs> Try to do this a little more sneaky and stealthy. Let's just go around this corner and bury the book. Whoop, 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 what's that? Nope, nope, not today. Going this way. I will be the number one waifu. That wasn't very kawaii, was it? You make me sick. I'm ready to confess my feelings. It's class time. Go to your class. You want some of the bit this bitch? You want to end up in a compost like everyone else? Yeah, that's what I thought. Now let me confess my love. Hey, Makio Senpai. I must confess. I did something. Hi, Akari chan. I'm overwhelmed. I'm exhausted with all these events. Yuka appeared too suddenly. I don't want any arranged weddings. Did you want to say something? Oh, so maybe we can spend some time together. Sure, why not? Are you prepared for the medical examination? I did not have dinner yesterday to lose weight, but I do not know if it can help. I don't like when another woman and Makio are alone together. Come to me after classes for an extended examination. You won't regret. What is she doing? I'll bury her for this. My diet What's this? A katana? Japanese steel forged 1,000 times! Like fuck you are. Ha! Ah! Who needs a fucking nurse now? Ah! Fucking hell, you're a heavy one. All right, let's do this. Nope, go about your business, ladies. Nothing to see here. All right, just gonna put you down for a second while I grab the shovel or fall through the world. That that that's probably not gonna count as hiding the body. All right. Let's hope I can fucking pull you out of there. Yep, yep. There we go. Up you get. Oh, still heavy. Just so you know, Senpai doesn't like fat girls. Oh, Akari, it's you. Sorry, I can't go for a walk now. I have to rewrite my test and visit the nurse later. I don't know what she wants. Recently, many girls were trying to attract my attention just to disappear later. I'm feeling lonely. The only one who is always near is you. You noticed. It's because I... I love you. Kiss me now, my senpai. 
Hi, Lu Wei. What plans do you have for tonight? My apartment's empty and I don't want to be alone anymore. That sounds intriguing indeed. Let's go. Finally, we reached home. I opened the door. My hands were shaking. I was really excited to be so close with my love. Immediately, we started struggling to get our clothes off. On the way home, we went by the pharmacy. I asked Makio to buy protection. He was kind of shy, and the old pharmacist just winked with no words. Nope, two things I don't fuck with is rattlesnakes and condoms. We threw ourselves into each other's embrace, kissing, and trying to take off the last pieces of our clothes. They're useless now. When we were ready, I just closed my eyes to imprint this moment in my memory, and started to feel love from deep inside. After it was over, we were kissing and hugging late into the night. I was absolutely happy, and so was my beloved. Eventually, we fell asleep under the moonlight. I don't know what I'm doing reading this book, I can't read Japanese. Well, we learned a lot about love today, and that you can kill to get the one you love. Not only that, but boy does it feel good. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day, senpai!